Steve, a nil-nil draw, do you think York were unlucky um, not to grab a win with the chances we had today? I think we were unlucky uh, in respect that we couldn't get on the end of one of those great crosses that the boys put in. Certainly first half we had probably a dozen balls fizz across the goal and we just couldn't get on the end of them. Uh, and it wasn't you know, it wasn't that the strikers and the midfielders weren't in there, it's just nothing fell in the right way, you know, whether they went through her legs or past us or in front of us. Uh, and it was one of those nights and I think it's important when you have one of those nights that you don't lose the game. And uh, you know, that's we take we'll take a point out of it. I thought we played I thought thought we played some great stuff, arguably some of the best football all season, certainly first half. Um, against a team who are you know very, very direct and very physical and they've scored hatfuls of goals this season, um, you know, to keep a clean sheet away from home against them. Another game unbeaten, but you know, obviously we'd have preferred preferred to win it, but lots of positives. Yeah, that being said, do you think guys have been the toughest contest so far for yourself? Yeah, that was that was hard work tonight. It was hard work. We would very rarely give you a respite because when you know when we when we want to breathe we try and keep the ball and we try and we, we try and build up play and get through the middle midfield and get out the other side it they just go forward and, and uh, there's very, 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 very little time to set up and have a rest. So yeah, the, the lads earned that earned that tonight. Um, goalkeeper made some good saves as he has done all season, Pete. Uh, but so did theirs. So yeah, I mean, it's probably you know probably a hard earned draw for both teams. Uh, and you know, near the end, I, th I think um, you know I think I think they got the stage where they they probably settle for a draw as well. Yeah, and their striker Aaron Martin scored ten goals this season already. Um, do you think it shows that his defence did a good job keeping him quiet? Yeah, I think I think young Harry had a good uh, good debut considering he's come up against the league's top scorer. Um, and you know he is a, he is a good player. It's the first time I saw him live. He's, he's, a, he's a handful. He's a, he's, a, he's a hard working lad, uh, and you can see why he scored so many goals. But as I say, a clean clean sheet and just just feel to latch onto one of the uh, one of the crosses and, and you know could have been sitting here with three points again, but. It's not to be. Yeah, making a positive change on something that is bringing Lang stuff off uh, on. Sorry, does that show that you thought you could go on to win the game? Yeah, we try to win the game. We've got to try and win every game. You know, I think we've got we've got we're in a situation where we're well drilled at the back. You know, we, we've got a good good record at the back. We, the lads know what they're doing, so we can afford to we can afford to go for it. I thought by keeping by keeping Alex on, by putting McCauley on, that's three strikers basically on the pitch at the same time. Uh, changed Nathan for Griff because Griff was getting a lot of the ball, but he was he was you know really sort of fatiguing a little bit last 15 minutes. Just thought Nathan might get on the ball a little bit, but I think by the time Nathan got on, I think they were at the stage where they were they were they were quite settled for the draw as well. Yeah, just looking at the league table, and we dropped down to second, but is it just focusing on we're unbeaten now? Yeah, it's you know it's. Uh, it's great to see your name at the top of the league, but you know you don't win anything for the start of September. So um, we're we're in and around where we need to be. You know we want to go up, and we're in and around the, the position to do that. We've still got, you know, we've still got teams to play. We've still got Kings Lynn to play. There's, there's, there's so much football that we played this season. I, I, you know, I don't think looking at the league at this stage of the season uh, there's, there's much benefit in it, apart from the fact that it's nice to see it when you when you are there. But uh, we we won't change the way we go about things. We're looking to get three points on Saturday now. Yeah, lastly, uh, Steve McNulty, how is he getting on? Improving. Um, we'll have another look at him on Thursday, assess where he's at. Um, if he comes through everything on Thursday, you know we, we'll think about we'll think about Saturday's team with him in mind. Um, if there's any doubt, then we won't we won't risk him. I don't think there's any need to. I think for the sake of one more game, maybe, um, and then you know making sure he's 100% right for going forwards is the right thing to do.